Spurgeon here with Revzilla TV to talk to you about the AGV Sport Tracer Jacket available at Revzilla.com. Now the Tracer Jacket is going to have a great 70s classic cafe style of this. This is really a jacket that you could wear on the motorcycle, but you could also wear it as a lifestyle piece when you head out to the bar at night, and it's really going to have that great cafe look. Also, this is going to be buffalo leather, so it's going to be a really soft, supple feel to it, and it's really going to set itself apart from some of the other bovine pieces that we're going to see in AGV Sports lineup. Now, Tony on my left-hand side is going to be 5 foot 10. He is going to be 190 pounds with a 42 inch chest, and we have him in a medium in this. Now, the AGV Sports size chart for this particular jacket is just a hair off, so pay attention. If you're looking at the alphanumeric size chart, it's going to be labeled as the textile size chart. Tony should be in a small according to his measurements. We did bump him up one size into a medium, so plan on bumping up one size from what the size chart recommends for you. Now, as far as sizes are concerned, it's available from a small up to a 3XL, and the one colorway that's available is going to be the black. Now, it does bear to mention, it almost has an inky nature to it. It's a black, but it almost has kind of like a, just picture when you were a kid and you were just drawing with that black pen on a piece of paper and had that kind of a sheen to it. That's really the kind of up-close look you get with this particular piece. Now, with AGV Sport, what you're going to see is they're really going to work quality into price, and they're really going to give you a nice feel. Sub $300, you're getting supple buffalo leather, really clean lines, no branding, and honestly, you're just getting a really great jacket for the money. Now, if you want to step up into something a little bit more sport-inspired, take a look at the Tornado jacket. The Tornado is going to take a step away from the retro feel and to give you a little bit more of a sport-styled inspired piece. But again, if you like that 70s retro look, the Tracer jacket is going to be for you. So let's take a look at what we have going on here. Starting at the collar and working our way through. Really nice mid-height single snap collar. And as you come through the body, again, this is going to be a 1.2 mil grade buffalo leather. It's going to be soft. You're going to feel like this jacket has been worn for 10 years already by the time you put it on. Really great feel to it. Clean lines throughout the shoulders as we work our way down. There is going to be CE level armor at the shoulders, at the elbows, and it's going to be a soft rubberized armor. Really comfortable, really great feel. Tony, I'm going to hold your hand up for a second. As you work your way through here, you're going to have a snap at the cuff, and you are going to have YKK zips throughout, so really nice clean lines, and you are going to have that entry point where if you do want to get through there, I like to actually take that and roll it back where it matches my gloves. It just gives me a little bit of a different feel to it. But again, everybody's got their own style for wearing a jacket. Now working their way through on this, what I like about this is the asymmetry that starts to come into play. You're going to have these extra pieces of leather on the right hand side that are just embroidered. And then you're also going to have that kind of embossed over on the left hand side. And that's really going to play back and forth. You are going to have the single breast pocket over the left breast. And then working your way through, you do have the dual hand warmer pockets tying it back in down below. YKK zips throughout the entire piece. Really nice kind of just overall classic look with that big metal zipper. Tony, go ahead and face sideways for me. Throw your hand up in the rider position. Now, nice neutral feel to the sleeve. You can wear this with a variety of different motorcycles from a cruiser to a cafe inspired bike. Really nice overall style to it. And you can see the lines start to just carry through from the shoulders all the way down the arms. And then as you work your way through, there is a Velcro adjuster at the waist. So Tony is a little bit slimmer around the waist, a little bit more built up up top, and he's able to fine tune this down to really hold tight against his waist. Tony, you can throw your arm down and face backwards for me. Now, as we start from the top, work our way down, one of the things that I really like about this is just a little bit of extra microfiber at the top of the collar adds to comfort. It feels really nice against the skin, doesn't cause any irritation. And as you work your way through this, you can see there's going to be a really nice clean line to this, slight drop seat. So if you are in more of that full tuck position, it's going to do a good job of covering you from where the pants end and the jacket begins. Now, the one nitpick that I did have with this, there's going to be a back pad in here. It's just a back pad. You want to take it, you want to get rid of it, and you want to go ahead and upgrade it to something like a force field back pad, or a force field back protector, rather, will fit right in there. Tony, you can go ahead and face forward for me. And I'm going to have you unzip the jacket. You can notice he's going to unsnip YKK zips as it comes down. There is going to be a thermal vest liner in this, quilted vest liner to help push you into the cooler months. It is going to be a full 360 zip to get that out. Once it's out, even if you're just rocking a t-shirt underneath there, there's going to be a really nice mesh sweat wicking liner lining the whole jacket. Now the one small minor nitpick I did want to point out, while the whole thing is done in this really nice buffalo leather, 
the placard behind the zipper, they carry through with the textile and it just kind of just detracts from the overall look, especially if you're someone that likes to wear your jacket open. But again, maybe that's just me. Tony, you can go ahead and zip that up for me. Now again, if you are rocking an old 70s CB550 or maybe a modern classic motorcycle and you want something that's going to give you that nice classic look to it, the AGV Sport Tracer Jacket is definitely one to consider. There's a ton of riders out there that are rocking AGV Sport. If you want to hear more about what they have to say, click the info button. Read what other AGV Sport Jackets riders are riding on their rides. If you have more questions for us, never hesitate. Get us on the phone, give us a call, 877-792-9455, or simply type us out an email, cs at revzilla.com. Thank you for joining us for this look at the AGV Sport Tracer Jacket. I'm Spurge. Enjoy the ride.